So this proofing game that I'm playing with Wish, you can either play in grass, where you put low value treats in the grass, or you can use a snuffle mat if you're working indoors, or a blanket with little folds and put low value treats. So her kibble that she doesn't particularly like, it's a little teeny kibble here that I've sprinkled in the mat for her to find. Um, now I'm gonna practice calling her away from it. So first, if you think your dog's not, or your puppy's really not gonna come, you can get your puppy to move away with a treat. Wish, look, a high value treat. So I've got some really good hot dog here and then practice the recall, wish come, where she can't reach the mat at first. To give her, you know, 100% success where it's not too hard. You can also click your dog choosing to come to you <clears throat> during the game. So if your dog thinks on their own to turn away and come to you, wow, that's amazing. Okay, ready? Okay, go get it, right here. Where are the treats? So now I'm gonna let her snuffle for those treats and I have really high value treats. So if you can't find a low value treat, maybe you can use bits of carrot or something that the dog doesn't really like. There we go. Now I'm gonna call her. Wish, come. Up, 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 yeah. Good job. I'm not gonna let her go back until I give her the release. Okay, go get it. Wish, come. Awesome, good girl. Good girl. I keep dropping treats. Wish. Good girl. Okay, go sniff. Wish, come. Yes, good girl, look. Woo, awesome. Awesome. Okay, go get it. Go get the treats in the snuffle mat right here. Right here. Awesome. I'm gonna try it off leash and with distance because I worked with her quite a quite a lot. She knows I'm gonna call her. Wish come. Awesome. Good girl. And I don't particularly care about sitting. Oh, wish. I didn't want to release her yet, but I'm talking. So I don't particularly care if the dog's not sitting. When they come to me, I'd rather just feed the dog for standing and then if you want to have a sit, then feed your, your puppy for coming to you and then sit, ask them to sit. Good girl. Sit. Good girl. But I personally, I don't have any, you know, I'm moving around usually so I don't specifically want my dog to come and sit with me. I'd rather she come and just settle or just stand and hang out with me. Are you ready? Okay, go sniff. Not you, Splashers. <laughs> go sniff, Wish. Splash free. Splash down. Wish, go sniff. Now I put hot dogs in there. And let's see if she can come away from eating the hot dogs. So if she couldn't, I could put her back on leash. Wish, come. So if she doesn't, I'm going to show her what I have. Click and treat and then release her. Okay, get it. calling her away from the same treats that I have right now and I'm using my voice and my movement to get her excited about me I have you know a, a faster rate of reinforcement than this mat because she has to look for it and when she comes to me she gets treat 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 splash go sniff now I'm gonna try with <laughs> with another dog competing for treats now if you have a guarding dog or a puppy this is not a good game to play but I figure it will make it harder for her because she might want to Stick around to make sure she gets all the treats. Wish, come! Good girl! Okay, go sniff. Wish, come! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Now I'm gonna try from a distance again. And I worked on the recall, so um, it's been, I've had her for uh, 10 weeks, is it? Yeah, 10 weeks. So the recall is really strong and highly reinforced. If you had just started working on the recall, this is not a good exercise because you really want to build the recall to have this extremely high reinforcement history before you start making it difficult. Wish, go sniff. Wish free. Go sniff. 
Um, I also trained her to, you know, leave dogs alone while they're eating, so it's kind of a little bit, she doesn't want to interfere with Splash eating. So Splash, sit. Push, get it. Good girl. Splash can snuffle over here. if I can get Splash to come to me while she's so distracted because she's like, woo, I'm not even training, I'm eating treats. Splash, come! Yeah! <laughs> and if your other, if your puppy comes when you call your adult dog um, and there's lots of distraction, I would feed it. Splash, okay, go sniff. Go sniff. Now I'm going to sprinkle just treats in the grass. Running out of treats? Oh, hi! If your dog chooses you over eating treats in the grass, that's also something you can click. And now I have to stop because I've run out of the high value treats and all I have is kibble left, so. Good girl. Okay, go sniff. I have a couple left. Go sniff. See if I can get both of them. Look, treats! What that? Right there. Uh, wish likes the frisbee, don't you? You prefer this, huh? 